meaningful piece of literature, nor do we dispute the importance of teaching our children the historical and moral lessons and realities of the Holocaust. The U.S. Holocaust Museum denounced the mouse ban, saying the book plays a vital role in educating people about the Holocaust. Andrea Fuji, ABC News, New York. Now to a controversy in L.A. County where a 26-year-old convicted of sexually assaulting a 10-year-old is going to remain in a juvenile detention facility. We will break down this case. Good morning. This is what it looks like today. We're going to get right back to temperatures around 47 degrees if you're heading out into our mountain communities. Now look at this. There's a chance for a snow flurry tomorrow, 5,000 feet. Well, we're going to cross our fingers for that. It's a 20% chance in the evening. And then we see those temperatures climb a little bit Sunday and Monday to up to about 52 degrees. Still windy. Canyons passes 40 to 45. Maybe isolated guests about 55 today. We'll talk all about those winds coming up. Stay with us. I am an American. I am an American. I am American. We are all Americans. And in our America, we choose to stand together. In our America, we lean on one another. In our America, we embrace our differences. In our America, we extend a helping hand. We believe in love. And not hate. In our America, we all belong. In our America, we all get to be free. Free to live. Free to love. Free to dream. This. This. This is our America. This is my LA. This is our LA. Hollywood really bad. Let's go discover the next American Idol. You know what you did? You make them cry. You know what that special place is? It's Hollywood. Would you like to go? Take me to my happy place. American Idol premieres Sunday, February 27th on ABC and stream on Hulu. Now, with so much hope for a brighter tomorrow filled with sunshine, it's time to rise, rise and shine. And we're celebrating by hitting the road. Let's do it. Traveling all across the country. Oh, my God. Rise and shine. Rise and shine. <laughs> Let it shine. Let it shine. Yes, it's time to celebrate and smile with... It's ABC's Good Morning America's Great Rise and Shine Tour. Good Morning America. Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. The Westbound 91 freeway is likely going to be a big mess this weekend. Yeah, we're live with more on why it's closing down. Plus, a lot of people in L.A. County unhappy after a 26-year-old convicted of sexually assaulting a 10-year-old ended up in a juvenile detention facility. We've got the latest. Also, oh, what a week. We made it to Friday. What are your weekend plans, huh? Well, it might get a little windy out there today. <laughs> we have a look at the forecast in your area. It doesn't matter. It's Friday. There's a big game on TV Sunday if you didn't hear. I'm Brandy Hitt. And I'm Leslie Sykes. Big game on TV, meaning you could shoot up to mountain high and ski, and maybe no one would be there because people would be trying to stay home for the game. Oh, I know what Leslie's brewing. She, we know what her plans are now, <laughs> Lopez. But I feel like I'm not in good enough shape to do yeah, that, oh, so I don't think on. I will. You, oh, come on. Uh, no, I won't. I don't think uh, I will. <laughs> anyway. Hey, Les. <laughs> But somebody will, and you gave them a great idea. Yeah. So you are welcome, whoever you are out there. Good morning. This is what it looks like outside. We're back to about 72 degrees out in downtown Los Angeles. We do expect to see Orange County reach the same. We have winds. The wind advisory will continue on for us today. And the very strong gusty winds that we're expecting to receive here really happening this morning through the afternoon, and they don't quiet down until about 10 o'clock. We're going to get rid of that wind advisory. So we have a couple more hours here uh, to go. We're back into areas of the beaches, back to 71 mountains 41 the high deserts around 59 we'll have some breezy weather tomorrow but nothing like what we're expecting to see here today we've seen some down trees too we'll send over to brianna ruffalo taking a look at traffic this morning how's it looking out on the road yeah good morning it hasn't been too bad just yet so in the four o'clock hour oh, we're pretty used to seeing a lot of green wide open freeways so it's not bad any incidents we have had not really causing much of a backup but just yet so uh, your commute times are looking pretty good we're looking at the 110 southbound everything's looking fine between the 
75 to the 105 in the Los Angeles area, about 11 minute commute there and the 170 southbound wide open as well as the 60 westbound right now. If you're heading from Ontario to downtown LA, just over about 30 minutes. We'll have another check on traffic coming up in just a little bit. I'll send it back to you ladies for now. OK, Brianna, speaking of traffic, you may want to steer clear of that westbound 91 freeway through Corona this week.